G-Dragon, the king of K-pop, has been in the entertainment industry since he was a child and achieved a lot that many idols envy. He joined Big Bang in 2006 and built his reputation among many other impressive members, including Tai Yang and many more. Due to his prominent idol skills, he became an idol of idols. However, with many fame problems piled up like crazy, causing many conspiracy theories in the world of K-pop. Recently, G-Dragon got involved in a drug case. What does G-Dragon have to say about this alleged use of drugs? Let's find out. G-Dragon, a big deal in K-pop and a member of the popular but trouble-filled group Big Bang, is being looked into by the police for suspected drug use. This is part of a growing trend, where South Korean entertainers are being investigated for similar reasons. In South Korea, the laws regarding illegal drugs are super strict. Even if someone uses drugs like marijuana legally in another country, they can still face legal trouble back home. This year, President Yoon suk Yul has been pushing for even tougher actions against drug traffickers. He's saying that the idea of South Korea being drug-free is no longer true, and he wants to change that. It's a challenging situation for celebrities like G-Dragon, given the strict stance on drugs in their home country. This news comes shortly after an investigation into Parasite actor Lee Sun kyun for alleged marijuana and psychoactive drug use. It seems like the entertainment industry in South Korea is grappling with these issues, as seen with actor Yoo Ha-in's recent indictment for alleged drug use. Big Bang, despite their massive success with over 140 million records sold worldwide since their debut in 2006, has had its fair share of controversies. Seung Ri retired in 2019 amid criminal investigations and was later sentenced for serious charges. Rapper T.O.P., who stepped back from Big Bang, also faced legal consequences for marijuana use in 2017. G-Dragon himself has been investigated for marijuana use in 2011, but was released without charges back then. It's a complex situation for the group, navigating fame alongside legal challenges. It's heartening to see G-Dragon's fans rallying around him during this challenging time. Social media, especially X, formerly known as Twitter, has become a space where fans are expressing their love and support for the K-pop star after his arrest on drug charges. The Incheon Metropolitan Police is conducting an investigation into the case, and the authorities have stated that they're looking into potential violations of the Narcotics Control Act. However, specific details about the type of drug involved are not being disclosed. Following this shocking news of investigation on G-Dragon, netizens have begun to shed light on videos months before that shows G-Dragon in an unusual or unstable state. Footage from his airport appearance where he appeared unstable had fans expressing their concerns given G-Dragon's past marijuana case. This video made fans get worried. Another video of G-Dragon went viral, which showed his instability and trouble while standing up at a wedding, exhibiting behavior that can be somehow related to drug abuse, including fidgeting and restlessness. Netizens weren't so shocked after hearing about G-Dragon's drug abuse news, since he's been dealing with drug news throughout his career. One fan stated that they're not very surprised, and how one can't stop taking drugs once they're used to it. I'm not very surprised. I guess once you try drugs, you can't ever stop. Another fan states that they've seen G-Dragon grow up from the time he was a child actor, and such allegations on him makes them feel weird. I'm not trying to shield him, but I've seen him grow up from the time he was a child actor, and it's just so sad. This feels weird. There are also a few fans on Twitter who are trying to support G-Dragon, and are empathizing with him saying how he went through such a hard time dealing with marijuana case in the past, and dealing with the same thing time and time again only makes things worse. Even his international fans are concerned and starting a movement to support him. In the past, G-Dragon was involved in a marijuana case, and it's brave of him to open up about his past marijuana scandal, which shed light on the circumstances surrounding it. He explained that the incident started at a party in Japan in May 2011, when he took a puff of a cigarette from someone he didn't know. Being intoxicated at the time, and feeling a sense of obligation as the host of the party, he didn't reject the offer, assuming it was a regular cigarette. G-Dragon acknowledged his lapse in judgment, admitting that he should have been more careful given his celebrity status. When questioned about the smell and appearance of marijuana versus regular tobacco, G-Dragon shared that he was really drunk and believed it to be a dark cigarette or cigar. He emphasized that he had never been exposed to marijuana before, so he couldn't differentiate the smells. Despite being a smoker, he thought the questionable cigarette looked exactly like the ones he typically smoked. Dai Sung also spoke about a challenging time in his life, specifically his car accident that led him to withdraw from public activities for nearly a year. He revealed the emotional toll it took on him, expressing how comments from netizens, including being called a murderer, deeply affected him. 
Daesung candidly shared that he even had suicidal thoughts in response to the overwhelming negativity. It's heartening to hear that the victim's family played a supportive role in Daesung's recovery, encouraging him to move forward. The openness of both G-Dragon and Daesung about their personal struggles adds a human touch to their celebrity status, emphasizing the importance of mental health and resilience in the face of adversity. But what does G-Dragon himself say about these alleged use of drugs? Well, his words are stated as, This is Kwon Ji Yong. First, there's no truth to the claim that I've taken drugs. Additionally, I have no relation to the news reports about the violation of the Act on the Control of Narcotics, etc., that was recently revealed in the media. However, because I know many people are concerned, I will actively cooperate with police investigations and will participate even more diligently. It's good to hear that G-Dragon is taking proactive steps to address the situation. His lawyer, Kim Soo-hyun, mentioned on October 31st that the rapper has provided all necessary evidence for the ongoing investigation. Additionally, G-Dragon is willingly cooperating with a hair and urine test, demonstrating a sincere effort to uncover the truth and prove his innocence. In a statement released on October 27th, G-Dragon himself clarified that he has not used drugs and emphasized that the reports about the violation of drug control laws are unrelated to him. Acknowledging the concerns of many people, he is sure that he will actively cooperate with the investigative agencies and comply with the investigation earnestly. It's a challenging time for G-Dragon, but his commitment to cooperation and the submission of evidence suggest a desire for transparency and resolution. As the legal process unfolds, it remains to be seen how these developments will impact the ongoing situation. The courts also denied the police's search request for G-Dragon's communications, and it looks like the legal proceedings for G-Dragon are unfolding with some interesting twists. The Incheon Police Narcotics Investigation Unit sought a search warrant to examine G-Dragon's communication records on October 30th. However, the Incheon District Court, after reviewing the case, rejected the request. The court cited a lack of evidence, stating that the statements received by the police were insufficient to issue the warrant. This decision adds an intriguing layer to the ongoing investigation, highlighting the importance of substantial evidence in legal matters. G-Dragon's case has parallels with his 2011 controversy involving illegal drug use. Back then, the case was suspended due to low consumption levels and his status as a first-time offender. It's interesting to see how G-Dragon's current situation is evolving, especially in the context of other high-profile cases like Parasite actor Lee Sun Kyun's drug investigations. Legal proceedings in the entertainment industry often attract significant attention, and this case is no exception. As the investigation continues, it'll be fascinating to see how the legal system handles the complexities surrounding G-Dragon's case. What do you guys think about G-Dragon's drug case? Will the truth come out? Let us know your thoughts about this shocking incident in the comments down below.